Good morning, everybody. I hope that this video finds you all safe and healthy and ready for the weekend. And uh, we're going to start with the core practice. So find a spot to relax, close your eyes, and take deep breaths. So uh, today I am grateful that it is the weekend and I'm hoping that we have some nice weather and we can go outside and enjoy ourselves a little bit. So that is what I'm grateful for today. So I picked a new book today, one that I just got. I found it at school um, and it's about the beach and it's silly. So I thought it'd be a good thing to start our weekend on being a little silly. It's called, If You Ever Want to Bring a Piano to the Beach, don't. If your mom says to get ready to play at the beach, she means with a boat or a frisbee or a shovel. She is not talking about a piano. If you roll out the piano anyway, she'll tell you, you'd better not lose it. You'll tell her that it's okay. You will hold on tight to your piano and keep it neat and clean. And you'll even promise to push it to the beach yourself. Cross your heart. But on the way, your arms will get heavy, then your legs will get draggy. So you'll find the perfect way to move the piano along. <laughs> when you feel rested, you will push it again. I think mom has more of a say in that than the little kid does. Once you're at the beach, you'll need to make sure the piano still works. Finally, you'll stop for a lunch break. The seagulls will want to share your egg and cheese sandwich. <laughs> oh no. This, you know, is not good for the piano, but you'll know just what to do. Bath time. Ew. Look at that piano. <laughs> You'll splish, you'll splash, the piano will bob up and down, and up and down, then up and away. Uh-oh. And out of reach. By now, of course, you'll wish you had played with a boat or a frisbee or a shovel at the beach instead of the piano. By now, you'll wish you had played with your baby sister instead of the piano. You'll be so mad, you will want to just go home. Well, here's what I would do if I were you. 
Borrow your brother's fishing line and cast it far, far out to catch your drifting piano. Then when you reel the line in, you might get your piano back. Or you might get... <laughs> a boat or a frisbee or a shovel. Yeah, if you ever want to bring a piano to the beach, don't. You might lose it. But you never know what you might find. That's the end of the story. I thought that would be a nice silly way to start the weekend. So I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And I will see you back here on Monday for our last week of school.